in a, for example, rule change. In 2006, my takedown, Roger, wouldn't be a takedown today. Really? And I'm still a champion. What, what, do you, what do you think about that Keenan Cornelius uh, match? It seems one everybody's, everybody's talking uh, about. He, he won the match. You think so? But I think I allow, he allowed himself the benefit of doubt. I think a guy on his level uh, should not allow that happen. Man, he had the guy sprawled on his stomach. And that's what I'm talking about. You don't lose that. Come on, the kid is a beast. He can take you down. He can pass. Pff, pass his guard is like arguably almost impossible. And he taps but, out everybody. He taps and he's selling himself too short. Mm -hmm. That's what I think about it. You know what I mean? He's neglecting himself the greatness that he can have. Come on, 30 seconds to go, pull guard. You have the greatest guard in the game. Do you think maybe the the most such a strong reaction after because, you know, he's complaining about this, he's complaining about the referees. Do you think a lot of it is just he was actually angry with himself for letting that happen? I believe deep inside he should be like the same way I met at myself with Pena. I had a strategy with Pena uh, and for that split cycle he swapped me and I'm like, oh, okay, he swapped me, I swapped him back. I got into that flow mode instead of like, F you, I'm, I'm standing up, I'm, you're not sweeping me, I'm ahead of you. You know what I mean? And, and that sometimes happens, but in my case, I don't compete as much. And I teach a lot, so sometimes my brain is not on that mode of like, I'm not accepting anything. 